Positively Milwaukee now, the hunger task force pushing on, serving people in need as the pandemic lingers into the new year. Tony Atkins now with more on the challenges they face and how they are still helping the people of Southeast Wisconsin. Ahead of the holidays, three large trucks of food loaded onto cars and given to the elderly ahead of the holidays. Today, I had a chance to speak to a number of people in this drive through about what this means to them. A line of seniors waiting in their cars. The hunger task force turning them away with cars filled with essential food items. Getting some food for Christmas. Seniors like Ruth Hendley says it makes a huge difference during the holidays. It means a lot, honey. You know, that's, this comes up to a lot of money and it's wonderful. You know, and if you, at least people have to come here, they won't starve. My name is Roger. I come here to get uh, help to get food. Roger, who didn't share his last name, walked to Wednesday's food distribution. It's a gift, it's a gift for people who don't have much. He needed a bigger cart to take his much needed groceries home. Hunger Task Force gave him a new one during our interview. They giving that away? It's for you, sir. You're going to get that cart with you today. Despite the good it does, the Hunger Task Force faces challenges of its own. We have to face a time when we're going to have limited supplies of food again. A food cliff is what they say they face when federal funding runs out at the end of the year. They await more funding in a Joe Biden administration. We're going to skitter off the cliff because the food that we were getting through the CARES Act and the support we were getting through the CARES Act is going to disappear. Sherry Tussler, executive director of the Hunger Task Force, says the mission to feed families will continue in the meantime. What keeps you going? Knowing that we were essential made all the difference in the world to me, um, knowing that we were going to make a difference. In a pandemic, it's essential work at a time where anyone could find themselves in need. In Milwaukee, Tony Atkins, TMJ4 News. If you can help out, please donate to the TMJ4 Home for the Holidays Virtual Food Drive. It's going on now through the end of the month. All you need to do is visit hungertaskforce.org slash holidays for more information.